Great. Very good. Okay, so I, I have played very little of this game in the last couple of weeks, obviously because of moving house and some university um, obligations. But what I did do off stream was I um, completed the, uh, the Colosseum of Fools. I did the, the final challenge. Um, let's see. And I collected all of the remaining charms that I had to go. So, um, pretty much was just missing Fluke Nest and there was one other. Um, it was another sort of, oh yeah, wait, was it this one? Fury of the Fallen? Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm fully stocked. I've got my full charm set up. And I actually have continued to avoid um, looking up too many guides about what I need to do. So I do, I do not know um, what to do with the white fragment yet. But um, I do know that there is now the option of going to the white palace, I believe. So I'm going to um, I'm going to do that. That's going to be the first thing. It's going to this could be <laughs> this could be a rough stream because um, I haven't played the game in weeks, and I'm gonna, I think I'm going to be doing. I think the path of pain is in the White Palace, from what I from what I've heard, what I understand, and I think that's what I'm going to be doing tonight. So this could be e either an extremely good idea or an extremely bad idea. Um, I'm hoping it's a good one. Uh, I'm in the pleasure house now, so I just need to... What's going to be quicker? Going down or up? Let's just go down. Uh, and i got to remember all of the controls. Uh, and I've got to... Um, and I've got to pick a new charm set, set up. Oh, Yonso, thank you for subscribing again. It's nice to have you back. Almost Dell, thank you for the follow as well. I miss, missed that before. Lovely. Pretty soon I'm going to be... Um, uh, I'm going to be streaming from a PC, so I'll, I'll be able to have, uh, uh, no, oh, actually, train's coming past now, I don't know if you can hear that. It's very quiet, even, um, even, you know, not considering the, the directional microphone. It's a little spooky, it's nice, it's a little, it's a light rail, um, it's a light rail situation, so the, the train line is, like, it, it's not it's not going all the time um, and the, the trains are all very nice and new and quiet so it's um it's pretty good um, where did we oh yeah that's right this is where we are King station cool I'm gonna have to put the compass back on boy it has been a minute um, okay so for anyone who's done path of pain, or the white, okay, I don't, I don't actually know if I'm doing the Path of Pain or not, but I'm definitely doing the White Palace. I may need a little guidance on what charms are going to be most useful for me. Because I don't know exactly what to expect. I'm just going to keep Grub Song on just because it's OP, IMO. We need the compass so that we can see. And I think, um, Mark of Pride, always. You've done White Palace, Yonso? Not the Path, okay. What did you find worked for you? Oh, that's right. The other, the, the final one was Joni's Blessing, I believe. It was, I had to, I had to, um, I had to have like 15 hearts in order to get the last one. I can't remember exactly what it was. Oh, and the Hive Blood. That was the other thing that I got. Hive Blood will be good. Okay. I trust you. I trust you, Seedling, as always. Okay. Well, when, I know when people um, when people are screaming at Yonso, they're usually screaming um, pretty logical facts. <laughs> uh, hidden station, right? Let's do this. Let's bloody get this. Um, how is everybody? Catch me up. What you all been doing the last couple of weeks? I've been, I've, I mean, I've spoken to a lot of you already, anyway, but. People only scream facts at you, that's true. 
I, oh, that was the other the thing I, I did was I, I fully upgraded my dream nail, which is why I know I can now um, dream nail this this guy because I was uh, I was told. Um, what was the other? Yeah, I got, I got like yeah, I got twenty seven hundred. Um, so uh, what is it? Um, it's not souls. Essence. Um, just pretty much from doing the trial, from, from doing the um, not the trial, the the Colosseum. That um, that I got so much from, I got so much essence from the enemies in that. Um, all right, let's do this. I probably have to fight this guy, right? Ooh, that's bright. Maybe I don't. Maybe this just gives me access. Oh. Oh, I was wrong. Oh god. Oh man, this is gonna be tough because I'm I'm completely out of practice for combat. So the 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 honey it like rejuvenates your oof your health, huh? Can I still heal? I can. Oh, okay, he's not that hard. We're good. It's into the palace. What are you? Oh, okay. That's just for bouncing off once. Is this? Is there anything down here? Death. Okay. Now I know from, uh, I've been listening to a lot of Hollow Knight music as um, study music recently. And this theme has come up a couple times. So I'm excited to hear it in context. Palace time, that's it. All right. Oh, okay. I'm really hoping that there's some, um, some good ass platforming um, in this section, and I'm pretty sure that's what Path of Pain is, right? It's like just a big platforming challenge. So I'm um, I'm excited for that if that is the case. Um, also, again, if if my um if the controllers if the, con the controller is too loud next to the microphone, I may need to readjust the direction it's pointing because I know that was an issue. Um, in a prior stream. Uh, I think I'm also going to get a, a, a bunch of lore here that I'm um, not privy to yet. Oh. This guy doesn't seem too too tough actually. Oh, that's like a Oh that's got the void. They've got the void in them. Um let me take a look at the, the old journal. Nondairy, how you doing? It's good to see you. Let's absolutely go. Um probably further down, right? Wing mold and king's mold. Didn't really seem like I was defeating these guys when I was um, jumping on them, but. Guard Construct of Hallownest's Palace, skilled wielder of the curved claw blade. The old king died long ago, but his influence echoes around us still. A creature like that, what did he desire? Void, yeah, a bit of void. I don't, I still not totally across what the void is. It seems bad, but we're also made of it. Um, so that'll probably, I mean, if I know anything about this game, that will probably not really be explained to me in any explicit way. What did that do? That's where I came from, right? Uh, okay, didn't really do anything. Void is void. That's all there is. Okay. 
Um, okay, so I probably I just have to flick a bunch of switches, right, to activate something or other. Oh, no, just... Oh, that's where it came from. Um, did anything change? That one looks different to the, um, the other totems. I guess that's the king. Maybe something's changed if I go back. Void is void. Ah, oh, this opened up. Ooh. Oh. Banksy. Welcome, how you doing? Good to see you. Thank you for welcoming me back. It's good to be back. Uh, probably shouldn't have left the most difficult part of the game to uh, to a point when I, I um, hadn't played for weeks. But, um, but I think I can make it work. It's like riding a bike, right? Is there a map of this section? Probably not, right? Oh, hello. Yeah. Yeah. We will wait, King. Oh. I'm not the king, though. Am I? The bike has <laughs> spikes and lava balls? Yeah. <laughs> Some bikes probably do. Wait, hold on. Am I back? It's like the same area as before. Is it? No, it's different. Yeah, a normal bike. Um, oh, okay. So we, I, now I have to find the next switch. Got it. Cool, cool, cool. There it is. Probably just have to kill a few more King's Molds. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, okay. I see. Oh, okay. This is going to be tough, huh? But I get it. Just some patience. A little bit of timing. See, dashing across doesn't actually help me there because I'm dashing directly into the path of the other saw blade. Hmm, can't jump over it that way. So... Huh. Um, how does the automatic healing work as well for higher blood? Because I, I haven't really used it. I checked it out when I first got it. Heals the bearer's wounds over time, allowing them to regain health without focusing soul. So if I just leave that there, that'll just... I'll just heal automatically. A 13-year-old yesterday who's beaten this game six times, two of which were steel soul, and evidently has every achievement verified by... by your dad or by their dad? Did your dad hear about this 13-year-old, or did their dad just brag about them? Okay. That's how I do it. Is it? Yes, it is. That's somehow I do that bit there. By their dad, okay. It wasn't your dad saying, oh my god, you gotta see this 13 year old. He's, he's so leaked. Their dad is the 13 year old. It's the other, that's the third option there. Okay. Huh. I just need to short hop rather than full jump. 
Oh boy. If this is uh if this is what I'm in for. This isn't even the path of pain, is it? This is fine. This is nothing. I've beaten harder games than this, surely. Now, Derry, how have you been? How's the last few weeks treated you? Actually, I will say, I um, I picked Spelunky two back up after not having played it for. I I, I kind of picked. I kept picking it up every now and then. I I kind of, I sort of retired because I wasn't making any progress on it, and um. I picked it back up uh, properly in the last couple of weeks since since the move in the last week or so, and um, I'm I'm way back in the Spelunky two hole again. I think I might do some more uh, Spelunky streams again soon. Every time you get hit, you need to wait a few seconds for High Blood to heal you. You've been better, but you'd rather just talk about HK. That's fine. We can just talk about HK. Um, and I've, I've been, not only have I been playing Spelunky 2 again, I've been doing much better than I ever had, which is a really cool feeling. It's, um, God, what do you do there? I'm waiting to see this high blend in action. Oh yeah. Does it fully heal you or does it just heal the, the partial high of heart? Um, but it looks like it just heals what, like, the, the, the mask that had been damaged. Just the one. Cool. Nice to have that confirmed. But yeah, playing, um, oh, no, screwed that up. Playing Spelunky again and, um, actually feeling, like, good at it is a cool feeling. I think, uh, Hollow Knight actually... Maybe helped me out a little bit with my with my spunky skills. They're not um, they're not exactly the same in feel. In fact, they're quite different in the way that they play. But um, just like precision platforming and timing and patience, and you really could make through this place with full health. Yeah, absolutely, of course. But I am I'm also I haven't I haven't been playing the game, so I'm. I'm relearning how to play. Okay. They go pretty quick. What am I supposed to do there? Am I supposed to like... I guess just like get to the left and then... Oh, thought I could sit there. I think I can if I just... I'm a little lower. There we go. There we go. There's that famous patience, that famous sleepy patience you'll tune in for. Uh, how have you been, Banksy, if you're still around? It's nice to see you again. I looked a stream of yours a little while ago. Um, I'm gonna try the, I'm gonna see what the other, what, what, what's in, in the other direction first before I do that. Get to full health, get hit wave for high blood. Oh, I see. I see. I see what you're saying. I thought you meant uh, just like someone who's good at the game can not get hit. Okay. Okay. No, there's nothing. There's nothing down here. All right. Soul blades it is. That's a really annoyingly precise jump that I have to make here. Ah, <laughs> I made it, but oh, that's nice. Oops. Not 
Not right there. Okay. Nice save, exactly. Not that time, though. It's all about the little jumps, right? There we go. Um, okay. Not bad. I just need to time this and drop down with it. There's nothing up. Not, I'm not a fan of how how shiny I look with, with this white background. Yeah, the the variable jump based on how long you press it for. I mean, that's that's a, a platforming staple. But it is very, it, it is really stark, the difference. You know, with Mario, I feel like it, um, there's kind of a, an input curve, maybe, like with a 2D Mario game, that this game is more, um, treats more static. And you know, as I've said a bunch of times, it really reminds me of Super Metroid, because that, in that game, you've got like the short hop where you don't turn into the ball, but then when you do the, the big hop, you do. Um, and it's cool that the game like registers your input as you're making it. It's really, um, it's one of the many things I like about Metroid. Oof, see that? First time. Okay. Easy. Mm, okay, this one might be. Thought I was done for then. Is that a platform? It is, isn't it? Can I? duck underneath this. No, there's no duck. <laughs> of course not. That's how you do it. Beautiful. Success. wonder if there is uh, much of a if there are many secret rooms in here that I'm missing. I love the detail in the backgrounds. It's just all of the, um, the beautiful window trimmings. Ooh. I'm not sure that that's how you're supposed to do that, but it's how I made it work. There we go. There's one in the whole palace, the whole place. Okay, I'll keep an eye out for possible locations. All right, we're good. Next elevator. Oh, wait. Is that not, did I not uh, unlock this? Or did I unlock something else? Huh. Okay. Below me. One secret room, one hidden bigger place. Is the hidden bigger place the path of paint? confused here. I thought I had exit. No, I don't want to exit. Um, 
And this is where I came from. Oh, I can see here there's two lights, so I need to find the other... Right, I need to find the other one before I can move up. I, I think, I feel like I've exhausted my options for... Okay, well, I've blocked that area off, which is nice. It lets me know that I've done everything that I can in there. Really love it when games do that. It's a very nice uh, quality of life thing that I think some games really neglect. Mario Odyssey did it fantastically. Having Cappy tell you when an area you'd been to was bone dry for moons was um was great. Maybe I do need to exit. No, I didn't need to. Can I just go back right back in? Okay, that's good. All right, well, huh. Can't go up the top left. Can't go back through there. Oh, okay, well. Oh, okay, so that, that did come up in my journal as something, right? Royal retainers. Okay. I need to fill this journal up. There we go. Huh. Okay, not down there. Am I just totally missing something? I need a little guidance if there's someone around who knows where I should be headed. I'm 13 in, in Hollow Knight? That's great. I've never won anything before in my life. Um, God. This is a little irritating. Bottom left is the only way I can go, but that, that was where I came from, so I thought... I didn't think there was much point in going that way, but maybe something else is unlocked. Oops. Or maybe, maybe this wasn't the way I came from. Okay, I need to... Oh, no, I haven't been here before. I have not been here before. I was mistaken. Almost. Okay, I'm gonna take that advice and let this. Oh no, I didn't let. It. I thought it, I thought it fully healed, but there's like a second before it solidifies. And pop. There we go. Can I reach that? No, not quite. Oof, this is tough. You did miss the Hive Knight fight, unfortunately, no dairy. I um I did that one off stream and it was the easiest boss fight in the game, I think. I think I finished it it was definitely first try. I think it only took me like it was less than a minute. I was I was extremely surprised. I think um, by the time I had done it, I was just way more powerful than you're supposed to be when you get to the hive. And I had also uh, just beaten the uh, the Colosseum. I was I was really feeling myself. I think that's the consensus. Okay. Well, I'm glad I 
It's not just me. Oof. Oh no, I have to drop all the way down. Okay. Uh, just the one. Well, I I mean I beat the I beat the trial of the fall or whatever the 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 final big fight where you fight the uh, what is it the god god tamer. Um. Oh, I also, I, I beat Grey Prince Zot once. Um, I know that you can fight him over and over again to get additional uh, words on his title. And I think, I don't, I don't know if the game gives you anything else apart from that, does it? I think it's just like totally optional to, to fight Grey Prince Zot again. Um, but I just, I thought I needed it for essence and then I ended up getting so much essence from um, just from regular regular old fights which was not expected almost it's not right how do I do this now huh there we go Yeah, Trial of the Fool really, um, it really grabbed its hooks in me. That was the, that was the first part of the game, because I, I tried it so, what seems like so long ago now, um, without realizing how long it went. And, um, you know, after I'd begun packing to come to the new place, uh, I, um, I, I knew I had like a couple free nights before I would need to pack away my consoles and I was like I'm just gonna get these last few I want to tick these these last few like random extraneous Hollow Knight things off before um, returning back to stream and the Colosseum was just the one that was just like nah I really don't want to have to stream this because it's so it takes so long I can't I, I was telling how many attempts I had made and then I lost count because um, I wanted to have the number for when I came back, I wanted to tell people how, how many times it took, but it was, it was a solid like, I want to say like three hours I probably spent on, just the just that final Colosseum fight. And the and the first few times I did it, sorry, not the first few times. It was the last few times I did it. I was getting all the way to the God Tamer, and just um. I think getting overwhelmed with um, with the, uh, the anxiety of failure. Because it, it was not a very hard fight, like that last one, but I was... Every time I got there, I was just like, okay, this is it, you can do it. <laughs> and then I, um... And I would just, uh... I think just get a little bit overwhelmed. And fail. And when I did it, I was like, amazing. <laughs> I, just, I felt so good. It was such a such a f fantastic achievement. It felt better than any, uh... Than any Dark Souls... Um success had any Dark Souls boss fight had felt. Didn't turn that right at all. It's nice to know I can just double jump up to that. But... Alright, let's get a full heal going before I continue. Um, but yeah, what a great um, sequence of fights you have to do there. It's so much fun. The configurations of different enemies that appear, um, it made me feel, uh, how I would imagine a speedrunner feels, where you just, you, you begin to learn the patterns and you begin to learn how to optimize it, so you're losing as little health as possible by the time you reach the really difficult sections. Not too eager there. Good. Nice. 
Yeah, exactly. When you begin to see the mate, you can just see see the numbers instead of the um, instead of the the objects. It really did feel like that. There were there were real moments where I was like, I found myself repeating exactly the same movement um, section of uh, attempt to attempt. There were there were moments like when the uh, exploding bats appear about like a quarter of the way through. And I realized that you don't have to deal with them. You can just like wall hop in the top left corner while they all explode and kill the other enemies that had spawned. It's like just fi finding these little optimization moments was so, um, thought I could do that in, in one. <laughs> um, yeah, it was so much fun. This left wall or the... Or am I, or is there a left wall above me that I'm missing? <laughs> Never mind. Okay, <laughs> that's funny. Huh? So do you have? To, maybe you just have to do it in one jump rather than double jumping here. Some of the rooms look similar, yeah. The whole place looks pretty uniform, honestly. Here we go. Nothing up there. Okay. Gonna need a bit of shush for this next section. This is a pixel perfect placement. Oh, almost. It's funny what the hitbox registers and what it doesn't sometimes. Because I, I swear sometimes I'm uh, dead and then I'm not. Oh, tough. Uh, I don't get infuriated non daring. I don't know if you've worked that out by now. I just get um, invigorated. See? This is a good section. I like this. Exactly. That's my secret, Captain. I'm always sleepy. Now, I I make uh, jokes using that quote pretty often, but here's my actual secret, is that I've never even seen that Avengers movie. I don't even know which one it is. I've not seen very many of those movies at all. But I, um, I know that quote from the meme, and so I, uh, and so I use it. That's my real secret, Captain. Oof. Here we go. And we're out. Now what are we trying to do here? Just... A simple dash across and then a, a double jump up to the that next wall. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not I yeah, the first Avengers, that's the one. I'm um I ain't got nothing against those movies. They're not for me. I was a I know I, I, I understand that my relationship to comic books and comic culture is a little unusual, so I do not um, begrudge anyone their roller coaster ride of a Hollywood movie. That's beautiful.
those um those bugs. Yeah. Just Whedon, of course. I forgot that he was involved in the Avengers verse. The MCU. Hmm. Oof, how do you do this? Do you have to pogo off the spikes? Seems dangerous. Huh, I think you have to pogo off the spikes at the end there. Pretty advanced move to put in this moment. Sure did do Buffy. I've only been watching Buffy for the first time uh, quite recently, been watching uh, I haven't, haven't had a sesh with so for a while with um, fellow streamer Cunty Demon. She and I were Skype watching Buffy together, and it was my first experience. She she demanded I participate in a in a, in a Buffy viewing. Um, hmm, this bit's a little concerning. I had a, a, a little bit of a problem with J Joss Whedon, just kind of broadly, because my main exposure to him was... Um, I think Firefly was the only thing that I'd really watched of his. Uh, and then... CD, what's CD? Is that a move that I'm forgetting that I have? Oh, Crystal Dash. Thank you for the reminder about an entire mechanic that um, the game has not made me do in several hours. Thank you. Way easier than what I was trying to do. Um, but then, yeah, what was the... Is it Cabin in the Woods? Is the, the other movie that he... Um, it's a movie that he wrote or, or produced or something. It was my only exposure to his vibe. It was um, the few episodes of Buffy that I'd seen and then Firefly and Cabin in the Woods. And I I felt like um, it was all pretty one note. Like there wasn't really much differentiating different characters. Everybody was very clever and quick-witted. Um, I liked Cabin in the Woods as a, like a deconstruction of horror while also like being a pretty scary movie. Yeah, this is the this is the place, right? Oh. This is the path of pain. To witness secret sealed, one must endure the harshest punishment. All right, I'm going to keep doing the this is this is very similar to the big um like the the cobweb section in um, Hornet's room, right? Kind of a similar sigil. Um, I'll see what's at the top of... Huh. Okay. Maybe I won't see what's at the top of this. Um, hmm. Oh, okay. I have to dash through it. Oh. Finish regular palace first? Yeah, that's the idea. Hmm. Okay. There was a, a bench back down here, right? I'm just going to do that. Feel safer. Um, yeah, but the limited Buffy exposure I had and then um, the impression I got from Firefly was... Uh, 
yeah, that everyone was kind of just, I don't know, it, it, it's the same thing that annoyed me about what I saw of Gilmore Girls. Everybody just had the, not everybody can be the smartest person in the room, you know, someone's got to be, someone's got to be the heel or the, or the, like not everyone can be lovable and clever. This seems, it seems like I'm approaching this incorrectly. I'm just gonna take a sip of water and have a think about this. Um, okay. Oh, okay. I just need to arc my jump over the bug rather than try and dash through it. There we go. That's much easier than what I was trying to do. Cool. You bench. Nothing up there. Let's continue the climb. Yeah, I, I noticed you could hit them, but every time I hit them, I found myself just being flung into the saw. Okay, which way am I going here? Not that way. Up. Not up, because I can't make my way over that. And the spikes to my right. Um, is this another crystal dash that I'm... I'm not seeing? No. Uh, oh, wait. That's how I do it. Pogo. Oof. Drop dash jump. That's another. Yeah, I know. I think I've, I think this way is going to be easier for me. The old drop dash jump. Um, it's got me into trouble a few times. Yeah. Now that's. I can reach this. But I just need to not mess up the timing. Oh, maybe I can't do it that way. Because the camera sort of changes weirdly, like expecting you to come from a different angle. So drop, dash, jump rather than drop, jump, dash. Let's try that. Oh. It comes so naturally to me to, um, to jump as I'm falling. Let's heal a bit first. Actually, be the way you're supposed to. <laughs> Drop dash jump. Drop dash jump. There we go. Thank you, non dairy, as always. So now I'm going left. Not quite. 
I got it. I always get it. Eventually. Especially when it comes to, um... Platforming sections. I feel like that's my bread and butter. Okay. Fine. Um, okay. Bit more patience again. I need it to be up. One, two. Oof. Okay, nice. Takes me back down. Okay. Game wants me to go this way, I guess. <laughs> go over. That's, that seemed maybe correct. I don't think I missed anything to the right there. I think it was just clouds. Pro strat. <laughs> okay, so I just Oof, these the, yeah, those those pikes are coming out at a, a a speed that I cannot um not cannot quite perceive, I guess. That is not how you did it. <laughs> Is there like a whole other section that I that I missed because I did what felt natural? <laughs> if so, that's um, that's fun. Right, I need to oh, not do that. After all this, I do not want to die. just what I saw okay cool so I'm not as I'm not quite as good as I thought I was huh oh no oh no damn it all I was doing was trying to oh you dash under and go from the left no that's no fun But it might be, <laughs> it might be safer. Okay. Let this health come back. Yash, no problem at all, buddy. I appreciate your presence at any time for any length of time. Uh, the bug game's great. I'm doing the sort of the last few things that I that I never got around to um, when I was playing it the other the other week and last month mm. might just uh, try and yeah okay that is that is a much easier way of doing that <laughs> how was food Yash what did you get to eat you're I, if I if I remember correctly you're not a fan of this game correct is that right? I'd be interested to hear your take on it, honestly. Now that I've um, spent some time with it. Oh boy, why does this keep happening?
There we go. Oh, yes, I do love Hungry Jacks. I was, uh, up until this recent move, I was living right near a Hungry Jacks and I was uh, eating it way too often. Damn, why am I screwing this up so much? There we go. Better. You like it, it's a fun game. You played a lot of Metro Manus, it's not your favorite. I, it's so funny that my experience is so opposite to yours because I've also played a lot of Metroidvanias and none of them have felt this fun to play. Um, nor have I enjoyed their world nearly this much. The only other the only other game that really comes close to it is um, Dandara from a few years ago, which um, mechanically was just like so cool feeling to play. Yonsu, you just went for a walk and saw a dinner party gone wrong. What do you mean by that? No, Derry, even though there's only one thing left in number of hours left of completing everything, oh boy, probably because it's a whole DLC. DLC. Yeah, that's the Grim Troop, right? I'm, I'm looking forward to um, getting into that. Okay. Let that health come back and... Uh, but yeah, like in terms of Metrovania, I, I don't know, like what do you... Um, Yash, what's, what would you consider to be the peak of the genre then in that case? You saw a couple walk out yelling, uh, saying, have a good life, etc. Real weird. Yeah, I've been uh, privy to those kinds of conversations. I've never luckily had a, um, a screaming match with a loved one in public. Have I? Let me just think. I don't want to lie to you guys. If I have, I'll tell you. I don't think I have. I've had like, um, quiet, sad moments with loved ones in public where it's like a, a soft cry and a gentle kind of back rub, but never a, never a screaming match. It's not, it's not really in my DNA. It's your ju juicy drama, yeah. I mean, it's, you're really just um, experiencing what the um, the uh, the reality TV show uh, machine is tapping into when people become addicted to those series. Is seeing that juicy drama. Hmm. Yeah, I love Super Metroid. Higurashi Castlevanias. What are those? Let me just make sure I know what those are. Is that like Rondo of Blood? Oh no, same thing of the night. Who did Rondo of Blood? Because that's my favorite Castlevania. That was Toru Hig uh, Higahara. Higihara. Um... That's my fa that's my favorite Castlevania. Aria of Sorrow is great. Never played Bloodstained. I, I haven't played the new Ori game either, um, but the first one I was not impressed by. Didn't like the jump. This is now this is funny. The combination of Grub Song and High of Blood is meaning that I'm actually gaining health over time by patiently waiting for the this master crystallize. I started off at, um, I think I was at two, two hearts before. Okay, there we go. We're back. Hmm, how did I do that one before? Oh wait, I just, uh, did I just 
jump straight up before? I think I did. Yeah, cool. Oh, now I'm using my sleepy noggin. Yeah, that's how you do it. It's those uh, those heart strats. Ori one is not great, so that you think the the new one might be worth me playing despite not liking it. Because if so, I'll try it. I'll stream it even maybe. Could be a good follow up to this. Although, um, maybe, maybe another Metroidvania is not what I need for myself. They're kind of stressful games to play for me sometimes. It's not my favorite genre, that's for sure. Okay. Beautiful. I remember what to do now. <laughs> yeah, I saw the trailer. It just seemed extremely similar to the first one. Which is why I didn't think it would be um, any different to play. But maybe that's... Maybe that's wrong. I swear I dashed. Um, maybe I'll try it a little off stream, and if I like the feeling, maybe I'll, um, hmm, yeah, if I like the feeling, maybe I'll stream it, I don't know, oh, wait, I, I, I remember now, god, I'm forgetting how to do everything, but you can cancel the dash, right, part way, yeah, thanks, not dairy. Right at the moment I worked it out. If honestly, if the platforming is similar, Yash, I think that was the thing that I, I took the most umbrage with from the first one was just that the platforming didn't feel very satisfying, which is the complete opposite to how I feel about this game. Although that said, this game I didn't love the feeling of initially it really took a couple of hours and a bunch of additional mechanics for me to really get into it so maybe I should give Ori more of a more of a shot how am I not lining this up correctly be a little quicker on the, the dismount. Um, honestly, the next game I wanted to stream, I wanted to play some Death Stranding again. I never finished it. Uh, I was thinking about starting a brand new save file, but I might just pick up my original save file. It's about like 20 hours into the game, but it was just at the point where um, I was getting all of the good movement options that, like, when the game kind of gets fun. <laughs> And I, I don't really want to slog through the opening again. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to, how to resolve that conundrum. There we go. Yeah, aligning with the background. I was lined up at that, that bar. That was that was how I was doing that, but... Um, okay. What have we got here? Oops. Um, is this just a simple jump and dash stitch? Seems like it might be. I'm just trying to get to that platform there, on the bottom right. Hmm. Didn't even need to dash. So honestly, this is what I thought Path of Pain was going to be. So if this is, if it, if Path of Pain is just a, a more difficult version of this, I'm psyched. Oh, 
Uf. Gonna be a little quicker here. I'm, I'm dashing too far. Where do I need to stand to make this work? Let's get that health and back out. A little quick. Yeah, she bought some medicinal stickers. You know, I have a lot more experience with that stuff. Happy to share when they arrive. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean by that. I'm going to be honest. There we go. Oh, I'm almost where you're at. Non oh, not dairy. I'd always assumed that you were... You had completed the game, 112%. There we go. Oof. Almost. Oh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm sure you'll tell me later. I, and I, and I, um, yeah. I look forward to receiving the explanation. Oops. <sighs> Damn, this distance is really hard to um, predict from the dash. Oh, you're just... You've just, uh, I, I imagine you've watched a few people stream it as well. I, I, I had guessed that perhaps you were someone who, um, scouted around on Twitch for people who were playing Hollow Knight and, and just dipped into the chat. That was, um, that was how I, I imagined it, it happened for me anyway. Oops. Alright, bit of patience here with this health cool snap 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 okay snap 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 Okay, I'm seeing where I need to line up now. To, to snap. To, oh, almost. To, to snap. Damn. Thought I had it. To, to snap. To, to snap. Hmm. Hmm. to tuck myself back a little bit once I've once I've dashed oh the timing on that last one is really hard to get so you have to kind of change the whole rhythm of the of, of how you how and when you're dashing Let's get, let's, let's not get, uh, let's not get too stressed out. 
There we go. Vladimir Pukin. Good luck for White Palace. This place is a blast, even though frustrating the first time. I'm having a great time. I'm not. Uh, I'm not worried. Thanks for joining. Beaten, redacted, or past the second pantheon yet? Not sure what redacted is. I imagine I'll learn one day. Snap. Turn, turn, snap. I might go make a cup of tea soon after I get past this section. That's gonna be my reward. Boom, snap. Oh, Redacted comes after this. Oh, shit. Then, um, then I'm, I'm intrigued. And a little worried. Duh, duh, snap. Oh, okay. Ah. Almost had it. I felt so good. Alright. No need to lose my cool. You have enough other band, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oof, okay. Man. The first one and the last one are the hardest to nail, honestly. Yeah, Path of Pain's a, a separate thing. There's a few there's a few like pretty big game moments that don't count towards completion percent. Which is um really interesting to me. Because like you think a game with, that would go to such a length as to even give you a completion percent that goes above 100% would just keep allowing things to be added to it, you know? Vladimir, I'm loving this energy. Thank you very much for the positivity in the chat. Extremely welcome. How am I how am I not able to snap through there? This part is unfortunately one of the more frustrating moments I've experienced in the White Palace so far. But that's okay. I don't get irritated. I get even. Definitely the biggest and longest Metrovania. There's so much content, especially for you pay it. Absolutely, Ash. I've um I've been astounded at the depth of the game. Um when I started I really did just you know, I, I heard that there were like multiple things that counted as the ending. Um and I really did just intend on doing like a main story playthrough. And then it, the more I play, the more I was just like, nah, I gotta see more of this. Thank you, thank you. It feels weird being a Sherpa when you haven't done some of the end game stuff. No, I think that's um I think that's kinda normal, like in life, you know? Coaches of sports teams are very rarely uh people who excel at the sport themselves. It's people who um 
know the most about it and can see what a person is good at and what they need help with. And that's all you're doing here. Crystal Dash would have helped too. Damn, you're right. Crystal Dash would have helped. Good point. How are you supposed to do this? How are you supposed to time this at all? Oh wait, am I supposed to do like a... Oh, you, okay, you can't do the, the shadow drop. Getting it, the timing right with Crystal Dash in the section would be a nightmare? Yeah, you're right. I'm glad I did it the way I did it. Damn it. I had it. I didn't realize there'd be a platform there. Now that I know, I'll take advantage. There we go. Okay. So... I feel like that was just one of many... Um, it's just Crystal Dash. Nope. Is this section new? Have I not, have I been here or have I not been here? I came up through this. Oh, okay. Both of there were two doors locked and now they're both unlocked. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. So this is all new. Something's never changed with me in Hollow Knight. One of those things is um, just totally boning simple jumps. Dance. Thank you very much for the, the beautiful six months. What a wonderful six months it's been. Appreciate you, King. Sorry about how washed out I look in this moment. Not ideal. So how am I supposed to do this? This feels tough. Am I supposed to go up? <laughs> I look great. Just need to up the up the brightness and the contrast at all times for all of my appearances. Um, drop dash jump. Oh, almost, almost had it. The old DDJ. Oh boy, this game. Okay. We can do this. Drop, dash, jump. Boom. Okay, now where? Not there. Not there either. How you doing, Dens? Study night tonight? I got it right the, the first time. As so often happens in this game, you just fluke a victory in a section that if you have to redo it, it's it's over. Maybe I should try waiting till it's at the bottom. 
that might, that feels better. I'm hesitating too much on the uh, the wall the wall jumps. I'm not dedicating. There we go. All oh, right, crystal dash. Of course. We love the beach. We love beach dance. Not great beach weather, but you know, I I ain't judging. I went for a, a swim in the pool this morning, so it wasn't really great pool weather either. Ah oh, man, <laughs> this bit's gonna be tough. This bit's gonna really do my head in. I can tell. These spears. Okay. Oh God. Ugh. <laughs> Rough. Cold, cold water is extremely good for you. I splash cold water on my face every morning, and that's how I look this young, in spite of my, in spite of my age. I, I, I've never done anything good for my body except every morning for the last twenty years. I've splashed cold water on my face first thing in the morning. Plus, it's actually better to go to the beach when the weather's shite because nobody else is there. Sleepy's actually 83 years old. Not far off, honestly. Not far off at all. Oof. That could have been extremely dire. Yeah. Salt water's good. Salt air. Lots of benefits to the beach. Not lots of non-weather benefits. Yeah, I love to... It, honestly, the only time I, lo I love to be at the beach is when it's empty. Cool. Alright, we're back here again. <laughs> Go Queen. Bro, is she single? Oh no, I double jumped when I meant to wall jump. Oof. Okay. This is the time. I feel a success in the pit of my stomach. wasn't success I felt. <laughs> you wouldn't dare ask? Neither. Neither honestly. I wish there was an easy way of getting up to this wall on the right. I didn't have to deal with this one this one saw every time. Could I gotta bring back the gotta bring back being patient. I don't want to know. Let, let the queen cook. Let her do her thing. There we go. Cool. All right. Oh, okay. That was wrong. Alright, let's line that up better. Oh. Damn. Only success is here. At twitch.tv slash v sleepy gamer. This feels very much like I'm reaching 
the apex. Yeah. Yeah, this feels this feels like end game stuff. Derry has more or less confirmed it with an end. Here we go. This is this is something. Whatever it is, it's something. Hey, enjoy your lurk, bro. Thanks for thanks for popping in. Thanks for subbing. Speak soon. Do a descending. Oh, okay. Cool. Good tip. I'll do that. Here, where this crack is. There we go. Nice. Good looking out, Vladimir. What's this? Just some secret hidden law, it seems. Nothing you can do. Beautiful. What's that song? Hey Soph! How are you doing just in time to see me do whatever I've got to do in here? It's supposed to be the room of the Hollow Knight when he was a kid, but no one really knows. Yeah, it does, it does seem like a child's room, doesn't it? I like that, I like that. It feels, um, it feels like, uh, uh, the, the room for, um, Hornet in um deep nest yeah the song did feel sort of familiar hey it's the king no cost too great Um, hello. More? No cost too great. I can see light above. Oh. Always more. No blazing kin, only one light shall shine against the dark. The worm becomes beacon, minds expanded to yield, to devote, eternity and promise and charge in progeny cursed. No blazing kin, only one light shall shine against the dark. The worm becomes beacon, minds expanded to yield, to devote. Okay, so. This feels interpretable. It doesn't feel too abstract. The worm becomes beacon, minds expanded to yield to devote. So the worm came to Hallow Nest and bugs began following the worm. And then the worm became the king too. So that all kind of checks out. Eternity and promise and charge in progeny cursed. Cursed progeny, like cursed children. A blazing king, only one light shall shine against the dark. So who were the children of the king? Was that Hornet's the child of the king, right? Is Hornet cursed? I could also be forgetting entire things that I've learned. Why, um... Is there anything else I can do? Can I attack him? I can. Oh. Oh, there we go. The king saw. Right. Yeah, it, it wasn't called Hello Nest when the worm arrived. Um, 
yeah, and he he sort of formed the society that became Hallow Nest. But the bugs were already here. Is is yeah, that was I kind of felt that because there are other bugs in the area that are not followers of the worm. Soul of worm, soul of root, heart of void. Huh. Great. So we've got the final charm, right? Holy charm symbolizing a union between higher beings. The bearer will slowly absorb the limit limitless soul contained within. That's cool. Opens the way to a birthplace. The worst charm in the game. Oh, I felt, I thought it might've been really good. It is five cost though, which is a lot. Um, cool. Well, I know I can go to Salubra now and get Salubra's blessing. So, uh, why don't I just quickly do that? What's the quickest way to her? Um, crossroads, right? Or can I not do crossroads because it's infected? Go down first. Oh, the birthplace, of course, the, um, the abyss. I am right there, aren't I? All right, screw it, let's do it. I also didn't do Path of Pain, so I'm gonna have to go back in and do that. No, no, you're right, I am right here. Makes total sense. I'm not here to fuck spiders, you know? I haven't seen one sexy spider in this game. It's just down here, right? Yeah, the birthplace of, oh, that's right, there's the kin. Oh, are they the cursed progeny? Hmm, this is all, it's all feeling like it's adding up to something, but I'm not exactly sure what yet. Oops. Um... I'm also not quite sure what the um, King Soul opens. Thanks for popping the Discord in on Dairy. Oh, wait, I need to um, equip it, don't I? Do I need to? Surely I need to um, have the charm equipped before I can, yeah. Yeah, that's okay. I'll just head back up. Whatever ye. No, that's okay. You're just eager to have me see all the cool things in the game. I get it. God, these bugs are like, they're so simple, but they just, they just happen to be in like the most inconvenient locations as you're climbing. I know I'm strapped. I know I'm fully strapped. I just um, I just need to have it. I need to have that thing on me, you know. Because it's one thing to have that thing on you. It's another thing to have that thing on you. You know. 
You know what I'm saying? You feel me? All right. Easy. I didn't take any time at all. All right. Um, there is just a bench on the other end here, right? King Saul, Grab Song, and then Long Nail, I guess, because I can't fit Mark of Pride in. And we're good. Let's hit the Abyss. Is it going to be obvious to me what opens with this King Saul? Because I do not remember any, like, locked gates. And I'm afraid of missing it. that it? Yeah. Ooh. Eerie. Oh. Yeah. Enormous cave made of my camp. God, this is extremely unnerving. Is there much to miss in here? If I if I go the wrong way, it's just dead ends. I hope I'm not missing like secret rooms. Cost too great. The king, the king's words. Mm. Referring to the knights, I guess. Oh, I dream now to myself, my reflection. Oh, I can move. Oh, there I am. So I'm just, wait, I'm just in the same place, but, oh, is this like a flashback? No mind to think. No will to break. Oh, I think I go this way. Ugh. Bodies, discarded bodies of old night vessels. Her voice to cry suffering. Born of God and Void. Yeah. He's talking about the he's talking about the vessels now, right? Oh.
That's not me. Is that the Hollow Knight? Huh. You shall seal the blinding light that plagues their dreams. You are the vessel. You are the Hollow Knight. Baby Hollow Knight. I collected the Void Heart. Did that replace the... The other charm? It did. So what does that do now? An emptiness that was hidden within now unconstrained unifies the Void under the Bearer's will. This, this charm is part of its Bearer and cannot be unequipped. Oh, okay. Yeah, his horns were different. I did notice that. Oh, they're not attacking me now that I have the void, the void heart. Damn. Okay. So, huh. So the lore stuff's been pretty. Pretty hard for me to completely feel confident understanding obviously because the game keeps so much hidden so uh, let's see what can i remember let me into my mind palace and see if i can work this out so the hollow knight was created to hold back the plague right so the dreamers were put into their dream state to keep that door locked so that the Hollow Knight couldn't be killed and couldn't ha and then that, that plague that the infestation couldn't be released. Yeah, the dream is the seal. So the king created the knights to find a vessel for the in infestation like the infection or the energy from that infection and the hollow knight was the one that was chosen for some reason just that of all because all of these guys were made the vessel was created and was filled with void energy presumably because the void can withstand the infestation right that makes sense because the void is like a separate like energy entity um that's part of this world but it's like below it kind of runs through it but it's like it's separate from it so i'm assuming that the void is unable to be infect infected in that same way that other bugs were and yeah, the Hollow Knight was just, like, chosen to be the vessel for it. Um, and then you are, like, the new vessel. You need to... That's why you need to wake the Dreamers, unseal the Hollow Knight. Then defeat it in combat, I guess. But it's been infested. It's been... So it can't withstand the infestation. Because it has been... It, it, is, it, is, it has succumbed to it by the time you... By the time you reach it. Although maybe that's why you need to defeat it and start it again. Start the whole cycle. That's pretty close safe for tiny details. Okay, cool. That feels good. I'm, I'm glad I am. Um, I'm glad I was able to kind of work that out for myself then. What tiny details am I missing? Because it might just be stuff that I'm forgetting. It has been like, you know, I've been playing this game for a couple months now. And um, I'm sure there's been little lore drops that didn't seem relevant to me at the mo in the moment. So the, the, the queen we met... So is she our mother? And Hornet is like my is like my half sister because it was a different. She was she her mum was one of the dreamers. Is that correct? Hair of the Beast. The Hollow Knight wasn't chosen. There was a test. Oh, getting out of the abyss is the test. The Hollow Knight. So we just w saw the Hollow Knight climb out. Right. So, here's the thing. Why did... If if the test to see who is worthy, which vessel is worthy, is to, is to climb out of the abyss 
to be greeted by the king. Why would we then dropped into the world in the Howling Cliffs? Why does our character begin their journey there and not in the Abyss? Is that Has that question been answered? Or is that unknown lore? Because that seems, because there's like a lot of signs um, around that seem to be, he was out, he came back. No one knows as far as you know. Okay. So presumably, the knight left and then returned. Interesting. Really interesting. Cool, cool game. So then what does this say again? Higher beings, these words are few alone. Why our pure verse, vessel has ascended. That, okay, all of that makes sense now. Beyond lies only the refuse and the regret of its creation. So this is just the dumping ground for the, the vessels that didn't pass the test. There is a room in the white palace that explains the vessel void thing. I thought I saw all of the rooms in the white palace, but, oh wait, at the end of the path of pain maybe? Ooh, do I just do the Path of Pain now, then? Oh, it's a hidden room. The aim of creating the vessels was to create a being that was devoid of mind and thought, as that was what the infect infection latched onto. Right. All of these kin you didn't, around you didn't meet that. The Holy Knight seemed to be the first. He wasn't. You are truly void. Oh, so you're like a, a more perfect vessel. Strange. Hmm. I got. I've, I feel like I've got more questions than I did before. 